Hello there, yellow group. Um, this is Miss Gross telling you about what your job is um, at this table today. So uh, we are going to focus in on how to write um, a CNN news fact from a CNN news story. But what we are going to make sure we do is write it in our own words. So in a few minutes, I'm going to play a video for you. And it's just a little brief news story that came from today's um, CNN student news. You can see it right here, February 26th. There's the uh, lovely um, summary, okay? And what then you are going to do is immediately after the video, you're going to go over to my, around my desk, there's a table right there, and you're going to open up a binder. Um, before you open the binder, you're also going to take your computer over to that table. You're going to shut it and put it there. And the reason why we're going to have you shut your computer and put it over the table on the table is because I want to see what you learned. I don't want you to go back to the video and tell me what the reporter said. So I want to know what you learned. And what I'm looking for is for you to tell me um, a fact. So it has to be accurate. It has to also mention a uh, time and a place, okay? It could be very general. Or if you do remember it from the video, it can be specific. Um, in the binder, you'll find out where to write this fact and what to do once you have finished writing the fact. So again, I'm going to play this video here for you. Then you're going to shut the hood of your computer. You're going to put it on the table next to Miss Gross's desk. You're going to open the binder, read what you're supposed to do, and then complete that back at your table. This is an individual assignment. So without further ado, let me play the video for you. If you have any questions, Always you can ask Ms. Gross. Here we go. What happened in rough water yesterday off New York's Rockaway Beach was a strong reminder of the risks that the Coast Guard takes when making a rescue. An urgent call came in at 2 in the morning. A 76-foot fishing boat had run aground and was taking on water. It had seven people aboard, and you can see it was close to shore. But the position of the boat in 10-foot waves made it hard and dangerous for the sailors to get out themselves. Five Coast Guard members tried to rescue them by sea, but their boat capsized in the waves. They were all wearing protective gear and were able to swim in themselves. But the initial problem remained. Rescuers had to find another way to get the fishermen. So the Coast Guard then tried and succeeded by air, lowering a basket by a helicopter to get the stranded men off the boat. The Coast Guard said that if the tide didn't carry the damaged vessel away from shore, the plan was to tow it back out to sea. As for the capsized rescue boat, it was eventually recovered on the beach.